Welcome to this demonstration of Microsoft Research Auto Collage. To start, select an image folder from the image browser. You can see how the loading is progressing, while valid images from this folder are displayed in the main workspace on the left. Use the slider in the Actions area to pick the number of images you wish for the collage, then click on the Create button to create your first Auto Collage. During creation, the images it has selected to be included are animated in the workspace. Once the outer collage has been created, you can look at it more closely by zooming and scrolling the image. On reflection, you may prefer to use more images or choose a different size for the outer collage, so change the slider as before. To change the layout, go to the Options dialog. On the Output tab, select the size. For example, use a 4 inch by 6 inch portrait layout. Now create a new outer collage. Note you will always be warned if you might lose an unsaved outer collage. You are shown the creation progress, which can be cancelled at any time if you wish to return. Note the changed layout. If you are happy with your outer collage, save the image. Outer collage will always suggest a unique file name based on the name of the image folder and the number of included images. To use an image set from another location, click the button on the image browser. From here you can select any local folder on your machine. Note how the image browser shows all the image folders in the new location, with the count of the images they contain. To continue, select an available image folder. You'll notice that the Create button is enabled before the images are finished loading. To zoom in on images before loading, you can click on them. To return, either click the image again or move the mouse out of the image. If there are more than 20 images, you can scroll through them using the mouse scroll wheel or the F7 and F8 function keys. To see any saved outer collages, click on the Saved button. From here you can browse through your saved outer collages, like this, or you can click on the Print Facility to print out any that you have saved. For more detailed help, you can always click on the Help icon. Thank you for listening and enjoy using Microsoft Research Outer Collage.